If you are getting an FO2 code in the display, this fault occurs when the sensor is either open or shorted. First try pressing the reset key on the display and go to the status menu by toggling through the display to see what the sensor is reading. If the reading does not match the temperature, then you will have to check the sensor with an electrical meter. To check if the sensor is bad, set your electrical meter to ohms value and measure the resistance by disconnecting the Molex connector from the sensor, then put the two leads from your meter into the sensor connection. Make sure to put your two leads into the two pins on the connector that correspond to the yellow wires. If you read zero, this means that the sensor is shorted. If you are getting a reading other than zero, check this reading against the chart within the manual to assure that the sensor is measuring a correct value based on a given temperature. Replace the sensor that does not read correctly or is shorted. If the sensor does not show a fault, check wiring and wiring two connectors. To check wiring, first, remove the 10-pin Molex connector and the 20-pin Molex connector from the control board. Once the two connectors are removed, locate the yellow wires in each connector. Now set your electrical meter to ohms, and the value should match the corresponding value that was measured from the sensor. If it does not, check the wiring two connectors to assure that there is no loose connection. If the wiring connection and the sensor are okay, you will have to replace the control. Once the corrections have been made, simply press the S4 reset key on your display to put unit back in operation. If you continue to have an issue, please call the factory for further assistance.